Hi, I'm Joni Mathis from the First United Methodist Church. And we have a committee to try and keep us all connected during this isolation time. So there's about 12 or more of us that are making calls to people in their homes, checking on them, make sure they're okay, if they need any help at all to get groceries or go to the pharmacy or whatever we can help them with. So um, I was, when they handed me a list of names, I have 25 people to call and I thought, 25 people and they want me to do this once a week. I thought, well, I might be isolated, but I'm pretty busy in my isolation. I thought, no, this is a good thing. This is a good program. Um, because the, the reception I've had from the people I've called has been phenomenal. They're like, some of them, of course, I don't know all these people. You know, they just gave me a list of names. And they, I think they're a little surprised that a stranger would care enough to call them and see if they were okay. So I explained what we were doing and they were like just wonderful. They were so happy that I called. You know sometimes when I call people I don't know I'm like oh I hope I'm not you know butting into their life too bad or something. You know some people don't like calls from strangers. But I haven't met that at all. Not at all. And even people I haven't been able to reach I let them know, I said, call me back. I said, if you have any questions or you just need to talk, and I've had many of them that I couldn't reach and left a message, call me back. And they have been delightful. I've had delightful conversations with these people. Betty Jones really stands out. She is 87. She's got terrible arthritis. She can hardly walk and she lives by herself. And she's a talker. Of course, so am I. So, I always leave an hour, hour and a half when I call Betty because that's how long we talk. <laughs> and, you know, it's just when she first gets on, she's a little down. By the time we get done with our chat, she, I could tell her spirits are uplifted and so are mine. She makes me laugh every time I talk to her. So it's really a good thing. Um, so let's stay connected. Let's keep calling people. Explain let's the book. care. Let's love. Um, also, the people that I call, I have all written down, two sheets of paper, and I make notes. How many times I called them, did I leave a message, did I talk to them? And so I can really, when I talk to them, get kind of personal with them, because they share stuff about their life, and I share things about my life. And I think it's just been a marvelous thing that we're doing this. So... Um, Hang in there, everybody. We're in this together, which is why we're doing the calling. And, you know, and it doesn't just have to be church members. It can be your neighbors. It can be your family members. Call people. They like to know that other people care, which we do, of course. So um, if you have any questions about the program, you can call me, Joni Mathis, 324-4603. You can call, I hate to give you Bob Val, but he knows about it too. He probably gets a ton of calls. Um, Kitty Maurer is running this program, and she's the one that kind of got the 12 or so of us together to do this program. So um, I want to thank you for your time, and I hope you're excited about this program as I am. Thank you very much. Have a good day.